Hey guys, I just want to do a update. It's been a while since I um, updated. I don't even remember when the last time was. Um, in the last update, I had said that my beta numbers were low. We were going to miscarry. Since then, I have done so. Um, I had been bleeding continuously up until yesterday. Um, it's it stopped now though every now and then I do have a, a little bit of spots here. Um, in regards to updates, some of you are already aware because you're on my Facebook group. Um, for those of you who aren't, I want to give you a, a bit of a background on what's going to be happening over the next couple of months. Okay, so um, I've been having some serious pain. I have been for the last four, maybe five cycles. Um, when I get my period, about five to six days before, I'm in excruciating pain. During the period, it is unbearable, and between two to ten days after my period, it is still pretty serious pain. Um, I do have endometriosis. I've had it removed previously. It's been about a year since my last laparoscopic operation. And um, when I get the operation, the pain does go away. It does help regulate my cycles, which is a good thing, of course. So, I'm on my way to England this week for a holiday. Once I get back, I'm scheduled for a lab. On Saturday, I have to start taking some progesterone called Dufostatin. I have to take that for 10 days. Then once I get back, I stop it and um, my period should come. Once my period is over, then I will be given the exact date for the laparoscopic. So that's going to happen next month in October. I'm hoping that it's not going to be a long recovery. Last time it did take eight weeks for me to get back to normal, but I'm hoping it's only going to be like one to two weeks max this time. So that's that. Laparoscopic is going to happen. It should help ease the pain. It'll help hopefully help um, in regards to getting us pregnant later on in the year. Um, I've been in contact with the clinic in Prague in the Czech Republic. The same clinic that we were going to use last year at this time um, for a donor cycle. So right now we are planning on cycling in February. Um, I don't have very many details yet. All I know is if we're planning a fresh donor cycle, so someone will go through the IVF process and donate all of her eggs to me, and then someone will also be donating sperm. Um, at some point over the next three or four weeks, I should get a profile of the donor, and I should get... Um, sort of the schedule for what we are supposed to be doing to prepare for this cycle. So we have a lap planned. We've got the cycle sort of planned. It's scheduled for February. I just don't know the dates, specific dates as of yet. And the other thing that I really want to do over the next couple of months is lose some more weight. I've already lost 18 pounds since about the middle of August. I'm hoping to, I would love, ideally I would like to get 70 pounds off by the end of January. That is highly unlikely. A more realistic goal is a be, uh, probably 40 to 50 pounds. And I'll be perfectly happy with that. Anything coming off is better than nothing in my opinion. Um, in regards to that, I have started a fertility weight loss group. I will link that below if you want to have a request to join that group. You're more than welcome to do so. 
Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to ask them, and I will answer them for you. I hope you're all well. Thank you for watching. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.